your turn, Stripes. Whoa! I'm Super Tiger Stripes! Ready, Super Tiger Stripes? Ready! Then let's show these guys what lions and tigers can do. Snapper trappers! Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Time to get these powers back to the animals where they belong. My trunk! It works! <laughs> it's great to be strong again! <laughs> My powers are back! Yeah! Yes! <laughs> All the powers I took are gone! Aw, oh, there, there, Lazard! Let it out! Lazard, those animal powers didn't belong to you! Yeah! They belong to all the animals. Oh, but I want a cool animal power, too. I mean, everybody else has one but me. <laughs> oh, <gasps> what? You just changed your color. Change my color? I can't change my color. Whoa! You did it again! <laughs> Look at that! Lazard, you do have a cool animal power. You have the power to change colors. You're a chameleon. <laughs> I'm a chameleon. Woo! <laughs> Who knew? Ooh, ooh, be yellow. <laughs> now be purple. <laughs> With orange polka dots. <laughs> <laughs> ooh, I'm picking up a scent. <gasps> Look. A giant carrot! We can feed that to a hungry bear! But this carrot's deep underground! How are we gonna dig it out before... <laughs> that bear gets here! <laughs> this sounds like a job for Excavator Stripes! Yeah! Go for it, Stripes! Instead of chasing us, he's eating the carrot. Check it out. There were eight hungry bears, but we just fed one of them a carrot. Let's count how many bears are still hungry. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven bears. And here they come. <laughs> seven bears chasing us, but Stripes just fed three of them carrots. Let's count how many are left. Count with me. One, two, three, four. Four bears. And here they are. <laughs> Stripes? 
Are you okay? We're stuck. This vine is too strong. I can't break free. Oh, that vine is really tough. <gasps> but I know something that can cut through it. Protractile claws. Hang on, Blaze. Ah! <laughs> Thanks, Stripes. Using your claws was a great idea. <gasps> Listen. Sounds like another racer's in trouble. Follow me. <gasps> Guys! Up here! It's Bam the Gorilla. Hang on, Bam! We'll get you down! Help us figure out which vine we should cut to set Bam free. There's a vine with red leaves, a vine with purple leaves, and a vine with yellow leaves. Which vine is Bam tangled in? Vine with red leaves, yeah! Great cat! Claws! <laughs> I'm free, thanks to you guys! Blaze! <gasps> Stripes! That sounds like Nelson the Rhino! Come on! <laughs> I can't break free! Sit tight, Nelson! We'll get you out of there. Which vine should we cut to free Nelson? The vine with blue leaves. Yeah! <laughs> Boy, am I glad to be out of there. Hey, has anyone seen Bunk? Help! This way! Oh, there he is! We'll get you down, Bunk! Now there are four vines. To save Bunk, which vine should we cut? The vine with orange leaves! Yeah! The mast to our sailboat has to be around here somewhere. Stripes, can you use your tiger sense to help us find it? You got it, Blaze. <laughs> Ooh, I'm picking up a scent. <laughs> the mast is somewhere over there. Remember, the mast for a boat is a long orange pole. Where's the mast? There it is, on that cliff way over there. Yeesh, but how are we gonna get there without falling into that goo? I can do it, I'm great at jumping. I'll just jump from rock to rock. Watch this, tiger claws. Ah! Uh-oh, I didn't make it. Ah! I'm slipping, ah! Hang on, Stripes. Okay, Stripes? Yeah, it's just, I know I could make it if I had a little more power. I know. Stripes, you can use wind power. If you wait until the wind is blowing, it can push you and help you jump farther. I like it. But how will I know if the wind is blowing fast enough? This can tell us. It's an anemometer. It measures how fast the wind is blowing. And the faster the wind blows, the more power it has to push you. Right now, it says the wind speed is two. But to push Stripes over to the rock, the wind speed needs to be six. Let's tell Stripes when the wind is at six. Count to six with us. Start at two. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Tell Stripes to jump. Say, jump, Stripes! Jump, Stripes! I made it! I felt the wind pushing me. Look, look, we're catching up. Caskets, 
We'd better grab the jungle horn before it goes down that waterfall. I missed. Let me try. Ah, oh, lug nuts. Oh no, it's almost at the falls. I can almost reach. Here, Stripes, hang on to me. Ha! I got it. Oh! oh no, we're too heavy. It's making the log unbalanced. To balance, we need something on the other side that weighs the same as me and Stripes. <gasps> the jungle horn. I can use it to call my animal friends. They can help us balance. It's working! Here come the frogs! Let's see if all those frogs weigh the same as Blazing Stripes. Switching to visor view. Blazing Stripes weigh 11. And together, all those frogs weigh... What number is this? Three! Yeah! But 11 is more than three. So that's not enough to balance the log. Quick, Stripes! Blow the jungle horn again! <laughs> Look! Here come the parrots! And monkeys! Now let's see how heavy that side is. What number is this? Nine! That's a lot! But it's still not as much as Blazing Stripes. Go for it, Stripes! Blow that jungle horn! <laughs> it's the panda bear! <laughs> How much do the animals weigh now? Eleven! Yes! They weigh the same as Blazing Stripes! All right! It worked, Stripes! Your animal friends balanced the law! <laughs> yeah! Thanks, animals! Now, everyone, follow me! Stop those monster machines with something like lasers or trash cans or, or lasers and trash cans. <laughs> I'll make laser trash cans. Yeah! Hoppin' hubcaps! Look at all them lasers! Huh, Zag not think lasers look so bad. Okay, that bad. Yeah, we need to be careful. A laser is a powerful beam of light, and light is made out of photons. The photons in a laser have so much energy, they can cut through things. But if photons hit something shiny, like a mirror, they bounce off and go in another direction. Huh, a mirror? You mean like this mirror? Stripes, that's perfect. Yeah, give it a try. All right. Ah, cool. The laser photons are bouncing away. Yeah. Can't catch me, lasers. I made it. Yeah, it worked. Shoo-wee. Tiger Claws! Sparky's Hedgehog! Don't worry, Sparky. I've got you. Oh, no! Stripes and Sparky are in trouble. Lugnuts, this dam is breaking, and water is pouring through those cracks. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Sparky! This calls for structural engineering. We need to fix those cracks and make the dam strong again. Ooh, I know what we can use. 
a concrete pump truck. It can pump concrete into the cracks to fill them up and stop the leaks. Great idea. Let's turn me into a concrete pump truck. First, we need a really tall boom arm to reach the cracks way up high. To make the boom arm, say, boom arm. Boom arm! Next, we need some piping for the concrete to flow through. To make the piping, say, piping. Piping! Awesome! Now we just need a pump to push out the concrete. To make the pump, say, pump. Pump! Oh yeah! I'm a concrete pump monster machine! Uh-oh! The water's getting higher! Sparks, Sparky! Hang on, Stripes! We're gonna fix that dam! Extending the boom arm! Turning on the pump! Time to blast some concrete! It's working, Blaze! The concrete is hardening and fixing the crack. Gaskets, we've got to hurry and fill the rest of these cracks or the whole dam will fall apart. I know. Let's use blazing speed and fix this dam super fast. To give me blazing speed, say, let's blaze. Let's, let's blaze. blaze. Yeah. 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 The dam is fixed! And look, the water's going down! Woohoo! We're saved, Sparky! Sparks Mark! <laughs> Stripes! Sparky! Oh, we're glad you two are okay. Oh, Sparky Spark! Oh, you're welcome, Sparky. Look! There's our sail! It blew all the way up to the top of that mountain. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. <laughs> oh, no! Crusher's trying to take our sail! You've got to get up that mountain before he does. Hey, I know. We can get to the sail super fast if we use wind power. We can use a kite. Kites use wind power to push them high in the sky. Let's build a kite so we can fly up and get that sail. First, I need a flying line. That's the long string that lets you control where the kite goes. To make the flying line, say, flying line. Flying line! Great! Next, we need a reel to control how high the kite flies. To make the reel, say, reel! Reel! Now to give the kite its shape, we need a frame. Say, frame! Frame! And last but not least, we need a cover so the wind has something to push against. Say, cover! Cover! Check it out! I'm a kite flying monster machine! Make an awesome kite, Blaze! Thanks, guys! Now grab onto that reel! This kite is ready to fly! Oh, yeah! It's working! The wind is pushing you higher! Woohoo! Yeah! Nice flying, Blaze! Finally! That sail is all mine! Oh, hey! It's Blaze the Kite! Blaze the what? <laughs> we got the sail! All right! Okay, guys, bring us down! Hey, check out this book I found! Uh, it's pretty heavy. All right. The green bucket used to weigh four. Now how much does the green bucket weigh? 
seven. What's more, seven or twelve? Twelve. Starla's bucket still weighs more. Oh, come on, y'all. You just got to make that green bucket a little heavier. Look what Zeg find. Big can of beans. <laughs> now how much does the green bucket weigh? with the green bucket. Both buckets weigh 12. They weigh the same. But to get Starla all the way up, we need the green bucket to weigh more than 12. If only we had something to make it a little heavier. Hey, what about the shovel? Yeah, toss it in. Look, the shovel made the green bucket weigh 13. Now which bucket weighs more? The green bucket! Yeah! Oh, yeah! 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 She made it! Good to have you back, Starla. Shoot, I can't thank you fellas enough for rescuing me. Let's hurry out of here so we can get you and your friends back to the race. Ooh, wee, Blaze! You must be mighty fast. He sure is. Blaze has blazing speed. I gotta turn off that bubble machine. Tiger Claw. Don't worry, animals. I turned off the bubble machine. Animals, where'd you go? Gaskets. Oh, no. All nine little animals are floating away in those bubbles. Poor animals, we've got to do something. Yeah, we've got to hurry and catch up with those bubbles so we can save the animals. Let's do it. Hang on, animals, we're coming. <laughs> and it looks like we'll need to add five gears to fix it. There's some gears. Is that five gears? No, that's only three gears. I found one more gear. Is that five gears? Not yet. Arr, how about now? Is that five gears? Yeah! wrong with this bridge? It's not strong enough to hold our weight. <laughs> Quick, everyone jump off before it falls. Yeah! Are you all right, Sparky? Spark, Spark. Hubcaps, look. Big pieces are missing from the bridge supports. <gasps> but those supports are what hold the bridge up, so heavy things can drive across. It's okay, Sparky. We can fix the bridge. We just need to do structural engineering. Spark. Structural engineering is when you figure out how to build things so they can hold lots of weight. Switching to visor view. For us to get across, the bridge needs to hold a weight of 10 tons. But right now, the supports can only hold two tons. We need to fix those holes in the supports. AJ, over here! I found some pieces to make the bridge stronger! Good going, Stripes! Spark! To fix the first support, we need a piece that's shaped like this. Which of these pieces has the same shape? That one! Yeah! Come on! Let's put it on the bridge! Yeah! Perfect fit! Spark! Now 
how the bridge can hold this much weight. What number is that? Four, yeah. But for us to drive across, it has to hold a weight of 10. Let's look for a piece to fix the next support. The piece we need is shaped like this. Which piece has the same shape? That one, right. I'll handle this. Sparky! Ah! Yeah! Good throw, Stripes! Hubcats! Mm. That chopping robot is eating the racetrack! Oh, man! We'll never finish the race if we can't get to the other side of the track! Don't worry, Stripes. That chopping robot can't stop us. We've got lion and tiger jumping power! Yeah! Lions and tigers are both great cats. And great cats have super strong leg muscles that let them jump really far. Ready, Stripes. Ready. Great cats, jump! Yeah! All right! We made it! Now let's keep going, but be on the lookout. Chompy the Chomping Robot is still out there somewhere. I hear him. Help us look for Chompy so we can jump over him. When you see Chompy up ahead, say Chompy. Chompy! Chompy! Woo! Yeah! Nice jumping! But be careful, everyone. Chompy is still out there somewhere. If you see Chompy again, say Chompy. Keep on the lookout. When you see Chompy, say Chompy. Chompy! Almost there, guys. Just a little farther. If you see Chompy again, say Chompy. It's gonna take more than a chomping robot to stop us, great cats. <laughs> this is where Stripes lives, inside this amazing treehouse. Treehouse is cool! Oh, thanks, AJ. But just wait! You guys haven't even seen the best part yet! Wait here! I just gotta climb up and get it! <laughs> Tiger Claws! We <laughs> are gonna love this! It's my jungle horn! Whoa! Wow! I've never seen a jungle horn before. Where'd you get it, Stripes? My animal friends gave it to me, and when I blow into it, the sound calls them. Come on, I'll show you! Monkeys, come on in. It's time to play. <laughs> That's so cool.
You're welcome, guys. It just goes to show that when you've got the right crew, there's nothing you can't do. <laughs> <laughs> now, come on, everybody. Let's slide. All right. Oh, come on, Crusher. Let's you and me go again. I, well, sure. I guess I could go for one more. <laughs> You can ask your parents to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Blaze and the Monster Machines YouTube channel for new videos every week. <laughs>